measuring the blood pressure, the sphygmomanometer. The only time you think about your blood pressure is when it is being measured. Do you know it makes a great bid to live a heart-healthy life? Without the heart, blood wouldn't be able to circulate through the body. Blood pressure is the pressure your blood exerts against the walls of the vessels as your heart pumps. Blood pressure rises with each heartbeat and falls when the heart relaxes between beats. Blood pressure comes from two physical forces. One is created by the heart as it pumps blood into the arteries and through the circulatory system. The other force comes from the arteries resisting the blood flow. Blood pressure is measured in terms of how high it can push a column of mercury in millimeters. The instrument used to measure blood pressure is Figmo manometer. Wind the cuff around the upper arm at about the heart level. Inflate it to a pressure higher than the expected blood pressure. It momentarily stops the blood flow. Then deflate the cuff slowly. With a stethoscope over the bronchial artery, listen to the beats and watch the sphygmomanometer gauge. Two readings are to be noted. When the cuff reaches systolic pressure, a clear tapping sound is heard in time with the heartbeat. As the cuff deflates further, the sound becomes quieter, but becomes louder again before disappearing altogether. The point at which the sound disappears is the diastolic pressure. A typical blood pressure reading for an adult might be 120 by 80 mmHg. These readings vary depending upon age and other factors. Thus, normal blood pressure is defined by a range of values. But be careful for a value of 140 by 90 or more is considered high. It means it is becoming harder for the blood to flow. Look at the values of normal blood pressure. The higher or top number 120 is called the systolic pressure. It represents the pressure while the heart contracts to pump blood to the body. The lower or bottom number 80 is called diastolic and represents the pressure when the heart relaxes between beats. The difference between the two pressures, that is 120 minus 80 is equal to 40 mmHg, is called the pulse pressure. The normal ratio of systolic blood pressure to diastolic blood pressure to pulse pressure is 3 is to 2 is to 1. High blood pressure, hypertension. Clinically, if the values of diastolic blood pressure exceeds 90 mmHg, it is a case of hypertension that is high blood pressure, low blood pressure, hypotension. Hypotension is said to occur when systolic blood pressure and diastolic blood pressure fall below the normal values to say 150 mmHg respectively.